Hello, visionary, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Raquel Reyna. In this video, I am talking about your money gates and channels in human design. If you are anything like me, you have seen a lot of people talking about manifestation. Maybe you've seen Abraham Hicks. Maybe you've watched Amanda Francis, the money queen. Maybe you've done some type of work that assists you in manifesting money. I am a human design teacher and I teach my students how to utilize their human design chart to fine tune their lives, their mission, their purpose, and of course, their power in making money. So the question I get asked all the time is what are the money gates and the channels and how does this affect the money making potential in your life? Well, there's a lot of different things in the chart that may be affecting how you make money, but it's not just about making money. It's also about the jobs, the careers, how many hours you can work. It's very complicated all the many aspects that we're looking at when it comes to your human design chart and making money. So today I'm going to ask you to pull out your chart. And if you'd like to grab the workbook and follow along in our four day challenge every year, we give back to the community four days where we support the entire community for free to learn about their human design, to learn about manifesting. This is the time of year to do it. There's so many New Year's resolutions, so many ways to manifest. And unless you've really studied yourself, then some of the tools may work for some people. And really all manifestation works. It's just a matter of who it's gonna work for and how they're going to utilize those tools. So the gift of human design is to understand the uniqueness in your chart and understand the things in your chart that you can integrate when you start learning the manifestation tools. So we do a four day challenge every year. And in these four days, we assist you in understanding and going back to the beginning of human design. So for those of you who are brand new and you want to learn about how the strategy works, how the GPS system works, you want to understand how to live your best life and kind of utilize this information to really step into the highest expression of yourself, this is the time to do it. So when you opt in, and I'll put a link in the description box, when you opt in, we're gonna send you a workbook. The workbook is gonna have you look at very specific places in your chart. The places that we're going to be looking at, and I'm gonna go in a lot more depth in these four days, we're going to be looking at the 214, the channel of the beat. But really the 14 is all about the resources and the money. The 214 is a huge foundational piece for the Penta and the WA, meaning for small businesses and large businesses. It's a direction with your money. And it can also be a direction of sabotaging your money and depending on what else is in your chart. So the other thing we're gonna look at is the ego, the defined or the undefined will. Now, if the defined, if the will has been beaten down and tortured by a family, and when I say tortured, I mean someone in the family thought you were less than or a loser or you could never really rise up in their eyes. These little cuts to the undefined ego are far more damaging than somebody that has a healthy willpower can kind of overcome it a little bit more. And so you might have the 214 or even the next channel we're looking at, the 2145, that channel of the king or the queen and really have the resources. If you don't really have this self-development and the self-confidence, then you may not be able to self-actualize in that channel either. I've seen uh, people destroy themselves 
who have all of the money channels in human design because they don't have a healthy self-esteem or because they might have an undefined head or there are other places inside their chart that's keeping them in an addiction mode or lack mode. So there's a lot of different themes running in the chart. There's a lot of different places to look at. And the next place we're gonna look at is that gate 48. That gate 48, that gate of depth, oftentimes keeps my clients um, and many, many people I know in my inner circle as well, keeps them from fully stepping out and having success in their life because they just feel that they don't know enough. And here you might see the imposter syndrome where they study, they get certified, they go to teach, they go to give readings, but they just don't feel like they know enough and they don't feel um, ready to charge for their work or make enough money doing what they love. And so they sacrifice themselves to try and get the next certification, get the next degree. Um, so those are the places we're looking in the chart. And then we're gonna go really deep into each one of these places and help you to really uncover these dynamics and support you in having the best possible time with setting goals, setting New Year's resolutions, and understanding how to integrate all of these pieces for your success and to understand why manifestation tools really work for some people, why they don't work for other people. There's so many, uh, so much more information to go on each one of these topics that we're going to go into in depth. So I will put the link to the Big Vision in Vision below, and I will look forward to seeing you um, in those four days in our Facebook group where we will be going live, going deep, supporting you, answering your questions. And this is our time to give back to the community and really supporting everybody um, on their journey. So we hope you join us there.